here. We're at Spring Shop picking up the newly finished F-350 by Roush. Time to take her back to the shop. Just picked up the Roush F-350 from the Spring Shop. It's crazy for being a truck this big that it rides so smooth. Especially over the Michigan potholes over every, on every street. They're dangerous over here. Even like the ones we're hitting now. Still rides pretty smooth. Yeah. Not good roads over here one bit. Being a truck this big sure eats it up. You wouldn't think that this was a big truck that you would be using to repo or tow cars around with. Yeah. Nope. Well, the crazy thing is, too, is that we have, what, 11, 1,200 pounds in the back? Yes, sir. No clip. You hear that? No clank. silence. No Nothing. clinking, no clanking, no rattles. Nothing. It's like a brand new truck off the lot. We're holding regular conversation like we're just in a regular old truck. Not like a truck that we're going to be making millions with. Another cool feature of these new Ford trucks is that you have your normal display up here, but you click of a button, you can also monitor your bed over here. You got a hitch camera. Over here, you got a regular rear view camera. This makes it easy for security. Make sure your load's still back there. So if you were to compare our rear suspension package to a stock F350, what you will notice, the helper pack on the top only has one thin spring. You'll also notice this large gap between the helper pad and that spring, causing a lot of, a lot of travel a lot of sag. This is completely erased with our package. As the helper pad has dropped down a little bit and we add some springs to that helper pack as well. Hey, bro. With our uh, custom rear suspension package, the helper pack has some extra springs in there. And notice the gap between the helper pad and the springs themselves. This significantly will help with sag, with any squat, so on and so forth. Also helps the truck ride a lot better. This is very important if you want to keep a comfortable truck, still be able to help with it. Welcome back guys to the vlog. Uh, we're back on this 2022 Roush F350 or 250. 350. 350. Uh, right now I am putting the main circuit breaker in the front and about to run the power wire to the rear of the toolbox. Uh, we're going to get that all aligned. Um, then we can put some fluid in the, uh, bo or in the pump and uh, start getting this unit running. Uh, after that, we're going to put the crossbar on, put the helpers on, and then we'll be able to test. All right, let's get to it. All right, now that we got the power wire ran, now we're gonna fill up the tank and get this unit to uh, function up, down, in and out. Get some uh, hydraulic fluid in the system. Good thing on these tanks, they actually got a sight glass on the side of them, and you can read how much fluid's in the tank by looking at the side of them. Now we uh, move the chain here. Make sure your chains are never down in these slots because you will bend your chain boxes.
bar is completed, Pathfinder recovery. About to throw it on, and this truck will be good for testing. Pathfinder Recoveries Roush after 50. We'll see how it does. windows down you can still talk without yelling at each other to in out all that bumpy at all just feels like a normal truck so we pay attention around the turns because of the reach of the little herc you go around turns without having to worry about smashing your rear bumper or tailgate Rise and drives like a normal truck, even with a load on it. Woo! I can feel the height difference, which is good. Left of the stop sign again. Bad, man. I mean, already, that's what I'm saying. Wait till you hit a nice. Bad at all. I thought it was going to be a tougher than uh, the, the Super Spring, but this is better than Super Spring. 100%. Jay's gonna let you know. Hey, yo, I'm in a pickup truck. I can do 20 hours again. Left? Uh, yep. Or straight, yep, it don't matter. But I just wanted you to see how nice that, you know what I mean? Yeah. And now that you got weight in the back, what a smooth, pleasurable ride. Yeah, this is comfortable. Make no bull for real. I, I mean, swear to God. Like I'm, I'm a, so I gotta buy a J one because he's got experience. I really don't feel like buying more records. No, because the insurance is gonna be cheaper on these. Everything is cheaper. Plus, you save thirty grand right off rip, not buying a record. Only thing I need a record for is yard truck. I would never ever make one of these yard truck. Ever. Oh, you know what you do with the yard truck is the forklift attachment. Yeah, you never gave me a price on that. Uh, they start at twelve grand. For the man, I appreciate everything they did. I'm gonna test it out. Welds are perfect. 
I got family members who are uh, welders. They work at shipyards. They've been working at shipyards for years. And uh, I sent them my photos. The... Yeah, they, that's the first thing I asked them okay. when they re redid the frame. They were like, man, whoever he's got doing this stuff, they do great work. So I appreciate everything. How was the ride when we test drove it? How did you feel the ride comfort was? The ride was actually more comfortable after than before. Believe it or not, I was shocked to see that because it sat, it already sat high. So um, I thought it was going to be off when I hit bumps or anything, but I actually, we hit the gas pretty hard. I mean, I accelerated and was hitting bumps on purpose, and it's actually more comfortable now than it was uh, when I bought it the first in. time. Yeah, I appreciate you. it. Thank you. Thank you so much, brother. All right, Pathfinder Recovery is taking home their Roush F350. Little Herc all tucked up in the back. Good back there. Gonna make some money. 